Hello there everyone, and welcome back to Victoria 2, I'm your host, Mr. Mocha Lover. And right now, as you can see on screen, we have just started a little bit of a kerfuffle between us and those Americanos. But we're actually on the default map mode, terrain map mode, because I never spend time here, but it is kind of nice to see. You know, what's a terrain of the United States? A little Appalachia, and the Rockies, and stuff like that, and a little bit of South America. They have a lot of, some very big mountain ranges down in South America, but I don't, I don't always spend a lot of time on this map mode, but that's alright. Cool. Hope you have. Hope you guys are doing or having a pretty good day. If I could speak correctly, now it's 1922, and apparently Albania has broken free from Yugoslavian rule, which is weird to say, but eh, it's all right. Um, someone did ask, what is the name of uh, the lake that's normally called Lake Victoria in our timeline? <laughs> and right now it's called Lake Napoleon. I guess the French were here first. Look at that, Lake Napoleon. Um, someone also commented saying that we should. Stay with the Wicks because they're pretty patriotic, or go reactionary because that's really cool as well. But we'll see. We'll definitely see. And I've already started attacking these guys just because I want, the, by the end of this campaign, all of the U.S. to be dead. I, I want all of Mexico and the U.S. and form the Golden Circle. That's at least my main goal. And I want to go back and kill off the U.K. Or the Commonwealth, I guess we should really say. Because they're right below us in terms of military score. They're second most industrious power because we're following in third place. And they're 18th most prestigious, which is fine with us. We'll see what happens. Hopefully we do well in this war, but there are no guarantees since I've already started launching soldiers into Spain. Spain is pain, yes. Malta goes bankrupt, so be it. Uh, killing thousands of soldiers off right there, which is very nice. How about over here? Good, good, good. They're in mountains, so we're definitely not even going to touch them there then. Alright, so first battle, we lost 9,200 versus 38,000. Philadelphia, we lost 43,000 in exchange for 15,000, which is pretty bad actually, but whatever. And it's just speak bay. We lost one ship in exchange for two others. Not bad. Um, let's see. You guys head up here this way as well. Actually, uh, actually, you guys go right there. Go to Atlantic City. I wonder if you guys go right there too. There you go. Can you guys come here to here? You might actually be able to beat these guys up. Oh, well, we lost 20,000 versus 24,000. So, not too bad. Not too great, but not too bad. Keep sitting them down. Because we have to deal with these guys over here too. Uh, you guys might just stay here. You might actually be able to win by doing that first. Cool. Now we're trying to build up more armies here too. Oh, that's not good. That's not good. There you go. We're still in defense. That's nice. And we're still in defense over here. We're still in attack over here. They're still attacking us over here. Alright, so we lost 3,600 for 67,000. And the Battle of Burlington, we lost th eh, 13,000 versus 8,000, which isn't great, but A, it is what it is. Man, attacking is just not feasible at this point anymore. Hey, we lost 15,000 versus... No, they lost 15,000 versus R9200. I'm going to send you guys up here just because I think it'd be time to attack before they get too much more organization, so... There you go. Very nice. And not bad. Head on in, boys. Before they get too much organization, we just killed off 55,000 enemies. That's impressive. Um, so the war of this time that we're in... Who are we trying to get? We're trying to get an event. And my goal right for this war is that eventually, if we wait too long, perhaps these the states that we can get two at a time right now might force us to take only one at a time. So we have 36 score, which means we have 64 score left. Um, 64, no. 64, no. And no, but we can probably get New Jersey. So we're trying to get both of those states. Uh, white piece, that's fine. <clears throat> Hopefully we do well here. Alright, we lost 258 versus 6100. That is not too shabby if I do say so myself. So, And it looks like we're losing quite a few guys around here, which is not very good. <clears throat> Alright, so all of Nevada is ours. Now, they're trying to siege us down in different various parts here. But hopefully they don't do that well. And I'm going to keep you guys down here. I'm going to keep you guys down here as well so we can completely surround them. Alright, not bad, not bad. 54,000 versus 3,000. 24,000 losses, which is really bad, but whatever. Oh, yes, still might be able to win down there. Uh, maybe they, they just don't have a lot of organization. Maybe, we'll see. Help out right there first. Alright, well, we got that battle taken care of. And we're losing a little bit of money, but we have more than enough to keep us nice and satisfied for right now. Alright, so what's going on? Um, oh, they're over there too, huh? Head on over here. Ooh, we have people over here too? Nice, you guys stay right there actually. Because if we have, well, one army. Where's the third army? Oh, there you are. 
So now you completely surround them. So then all they have to attack us, which is really nice to see, actually. So gotta keep an eye on them. I'll uh, take out Blossom, which is very good. Very, very nice. And we lost quite a few guys, but that's alright. Where are they headed to? Whaling Sport? Uh, they still have quite a few guys. So let's wait and recover some of our soldiers first. Oh! Well, there you go. So I want you guys to go around, 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 maybe, if it's possible. Uh, let's see. That's a lot of guys. Alright, trade unions, we want to read about that, please go right ahead. I'm not going to declare them illegal, no siree. And we kill off to a thousand there, not bad. And we got what we wanted. Now, I didn't really want New Jersey, because I've, actually I've heard a lot of people don't like New Jersey. So we don't either for right now. But uh, I heard they're actually really, really, really high taxes there. Holy crap. Anyways, um, you guys go... Actually, nope, time for tried and true little method of going back to Mexico. Because we love Mexico here. Because it's already 22, and we could probably go back to war with them anyways. That looks incredibly... Holy crap. Well, sitting you down here anyways. You never know what might happen. Hey, we got Nevada though. Look at that. Beautiful, my friends. Absolutely beautiful. Mexico City. Yes, please. Head on down there. And I'll throw one of you guys up here, too. That should be more than enough to deal with these guys. And now we take New Jersey and Nevada. They are kind of ranked up here. New Jersey's doing pretty darn well, so... Very nice. Nevada, not so much. But that's alright. You guys are the one we're trying to make to a bigger fleet of. We're going to send you guys down here, too. And so we have now, technically, two fleets with which we can pull more resources from. It doesn't look like we're making anyone else, so we've got these guys, so we got two engineers. Let's go ahead and grab seven cannons. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and that'll be two, actually. So that makes it nine, because I do want to grab one thing of armor. Now let's grab some infantry. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight. Nine, ten. There you go. Cool. Because we got to keep making a bigger, bigger armor. Army. Army, 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 army. Immigration. Immigrant deported. So be it. And we do have some coffee to keep us nice and warm as we're preparing to go to war with good old Mexico. Cool. And that's looking... That's Honestly, that's looking a lot better. We have these guys as our puppet. We have, actually, Colombia as our puppet as well, which is going to increase the relations right now. China's restoration of the order of the Qinghai provinces. Well, China's not doing very well right now, are they? Actually, how are you losing so badly? They haven't taken over any of your territory. Huh. Alright, well, whatever. Bulgaria? Bulgaria. Thank you very much. And we will ha only have seven of me. Not bad. Not too shabby. Oh, and Russia is having some problems. That's pretty normal. Also, I didn't think off screen Germany did go to war with the UK, France, as well as Russia. And they're still number one. Oh, their military is actually recovering. Look at that. Oh, they got. Oh, they got rebels. Dutch patriots. Oh, that's not good. North German communists. Uh, I think they'll take care of them, but that's not very good to see for them. Cool. They'll not accept. Going to increase relations. Anyways, cultural enrichment. Yes, please. Yeah, New Jersey, yeah, Atlantic City. I don't know, man. Uh, and before we keep moving on, we get seven, almost 17,000 immigrants every single day. That's so awesome. And America's actually losing 200 immigrants. That's pretty That's pretty cool, actually. 15, 16,000. Jesus, look at that. That's so good. It's so good. Especially from Russia. Wow, it's mostly from Russia. 15,000 from Russia. That's awesome. Yeah, Russia, you keep doing what you're doing. <laughs> What 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 are you what are you doing, Russia? I mean, yeah, you're reactionaries, but we're almost reactionaries. We're just conservatives. All right, yep, Argentina, sure, why not? Do not campaign. I don't want to lose plurality. Thank you very much. Black shirts, we love black shirts here. All right, let's go ahead and go to war. Did that army that had no soldiers in it finally figure itself out? It looks like they did. Let's go in. So now that's all we need. You can call our allies in, I guess. Um, everyone will accept. So why not? There you go. I'm not going to attack into the mountains like crazy person yet. Even though I probably will, honestly. So. And I do realize that these guys are missing one infantry, so. 
Mexico must be like, what did we do to upset the Confederates in this timeline? What did we do? Oh god, they're actually attacking me. That's pretty bad. Hey, more digging cap. <laughs> Just what we needed. More digging cap. Ah, uh, and get. And we're gonna finish off the army trait here with modern divisional structure. I love Mexico. Nice. Beautiful, my friends. Absolutely beautiful. 29,000 more Mexicans have died. Well, just don't resist. Just don't resist. That's all you have to do. Just not resist. And you will be taken care of, my friends. Ah, send you guys up here. You're pretty much already done. We're almost done with the war anyway, so... Um, you guys come back down here, because we might have to go back to war with, what, Colombia sometime, maybe? Oh, well, we can command the units, which I never do, but that's really cool. Wow, that's really overpowered. 3,700 versus 61, you know, brigades or divisions. Wow. Nice. Alright, I'm going to send these guys home. Um, that's good enough for me. Uh, go up to Dover. Yes. No, what the heck? Oh, you're trying to pull a sneaky one on us, Mexico. Oh, boy. No sneak here. No sneak. I got some rebels, pretty normal for them. But the French American summit of 1922 is success. Alright. Is America still a great power? They might still be. Yeah, they are. It's just because of that high industrial score because of New York. New York, and especially Pennsylvania, Massachusetts. They still have Uruguay? Oh, we didn't take Uruguay from them. Uh, there's too much attrition here for me to really like this. Good Cleveland. Oh, there's a lot of ships, but fun sanitarium. Thus, an additional few thousand dead this year can be attributed to the ravages of tuberculosis in our state. A local physician's privately published reports on the, on the state of the health care in this home state has caused a small public uproar in the CSA. Among general talk as uh, of the unsanitary and crap living conditions that the disease seems to thrive on, the report is also severely critical of the government for not doing more preventing the spread of tuberculosis by a stricter policy of quarantine, and for not providing adequate facilities for treatment. Conservatives lampoon the report as a historical opinion piece, and acting on it might anger them. On the other hand, we could use a sanitarium. Find a local one? Ignore the report to please conservatives. Seek local funders for a sanitarium. Oh, yeah, that seems pretty good. Don't want too many diseases. Just enough, though. Alright, Mexico. Actually, there you go. I don't want to use our stuff up. Beautiful, my friends. Absolutely beautiful. Alright, so what are we spending so much money on? Uh, what is this? Naval units do cost a lot, but so does land units. Tariffs are, are pretty high, too. I don't want cutting this down maybe a little bit more. Because I want to cut down tariffs as well. There. Oh, wow, that's a lot more money. Cool. I'm going to send you guys back up here, too. Washington. Hagerstown. Wheeling. Because we're not done with America yet. We're never done with America. And to making sure our capital does never get assaulted, I, we have 72,000 men in the capital. So, let's see what happens. Uh, you need to go up to Hamilton. And you guys are headed up to there. That's good. Very good. Cool. And now we can complete the Golden Circle. The circle is now complete. All of Mexico and the lands touching the Caribbean Sea must be ours. The international community may unite against us, but the Confederacy will defy them all. Will the rebel yell more, more, more? Beautiful, my friends. So we lose a lot of prestige. Holy crap. We get so much infamy. Whoa. We lose 20 more plurality. We get a lot more courts, which don't get me wrong. I love it. Oh, Medellin. Wait, we get a core of Medellin? Wait, isn't that down here? Yeah, this is literally the state. Oh, they're our puppet, though. Oh, that's not good. Well, we gotta cut down our infamy to basically nothing, then. If that's the case, we're spending this little. Uh, let's go ahead and cut this way down, then. Well. There you go. That's good enough. I don't mind making a lukewarm amount, but just make sure that we are doing okay with that stuff. Well, let's not go to war for now. I'm still trying to build up some uh, dreadnoughts. And maybe some subs. I've never used subs before, so we'll try that out. We're almost done here, and another army's been made. Well, not exactly. That's a lot of... <laughs> That's a lot of uh, backup units. Um, let's see. They finally made them. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. There you go. Rebellion inner ally. Turkey, whatever. Oh! The Ottoman Empire is dead. Long live Turkey, I guess. Actually, if that's the case, go and give me just one of these infantry guys. Actually, screw it. Give me two, one more, two. Let's 
Cool. All right. Now, boom, 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 boom. Now, we can't get quite up there, but if we do this, then we might be able to, actually. Since we do have a little bit of time right now. There you go. Fascist? Wow, 70% fascism. Wow. Come to Atlantic City. There you go. Oh, uh, we don't need you guys then. Head back home. Um, wow. Russia. Russia. What are... Well, there's Turkey. Dividends are nice. So that's weird. We won't be able to... Comp well, really, we won't be able to 100% complete the Commonwealth. The Commonwealth. The, uh... That's success, huh? The... Golden Circle. I can't think of the name for some reason. But that's alright for now. Uh, go up by three, maybe. We're still taxing the rich people, too, so there you go. As long as the green line is green, that's all I ma that matters to me. So, do we actually have course on you guys? No, we don't. So, do we have... No? It's just this group. We will get cords on these group, but we can't. We don't see them yet just because we can't get them yet, so... <sighs> Pretty good. Our core population is what? Our total population is 153 million. It's going up by 10... 100,000 every, like, 10 days. Wow. Oh! Like I said earlier, or in the last video, everything is becoming more and more fascist. What is up with that? Is that what Blood and Iron likes to do? Hmm, maybe. Sweden, your turn. Alright, very nice. America's barely holding on to 8th place, that's fine with us. Still losing quite a bit of money, but that's all right. Let's see. So we've got to take one of these guys out. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. It's a little better. So you guys are here instantly. That's fine with me first. So those that's looking not terrible. You guys have I oh, still one too many armors, huh? There you go. And then. Let me get rid of three infantry. There you go. And I'll send you guys up to Trenton. Nice. Not bad. Pretty good. Pretty darn good. Let's let's just cut down that infamy. Make more divisions. Feel a little bit better about ourselves. We're still allied with the Germans, which would be great. They have a truce with them until when? The twenty fourth. Do it. Mm. We might want to plan it so the Germany goes to war with them. But we also go to war with them at the same time. I might not. I might go to war with them, but not call our allies in. And by our allies, I mean everybody we're going to call in except for Germany. That might be my game plan. Cool. And there you go. It's fine. What do we have here? All right. So what do we have left? Well, we need four more divisions of infantry. That's all we really need. We're we still making that. Maybe a little bit. Maybe a little bit. Now we need three. Alright, not bad. So it looks like we've got one. So we need two more. Alright. Mexican infantry, we love Mexicans here. And Nahua. Oh, look at that! We're the largest military on the planet. As any good American or Confederate should be. Oh, and also we were... I forgot about this group, but we still have some guys on here too. Yeah, it's weird. Nah, we're not getting nearly as much immigration now because of Russia. Russia must be doing better. Germany, P Germans, Japanese love coming here too. Eh, we do that one fine. Military coup d'etat. Dogma of violence. Political violence has claimed several lives in one of our states. As fascist paramilitary stormed the HQ of the local Liberal Party yesterday, killing three and wounding several more. The action has been met with reaction during the night as fascists, socialists, and citizens guards engage in street fighting throughout. The situation has exploded out of a relative calm, and many of the citizens are in a state of angry, afraid, and concerned about where the country is heading, with several suggesting increased police budget as a means to ensure state control. So, martial, martial law. Issue a national apology to the Liberal Party for the state's view in protecting them. More liberal... Um, I don't really. Uh, I don't want to lose plurality, really. Hmm. Population growth does go down, but it's gonna go down anyway. So, and eh, do that one. It's all right. Things happen. Cool. So we need at least. We'll see. We have Pennsylvania, Massachusetts, and New York. That's it. Oh yeah. Let's begin integrating Idaho. Oh, we don't really take any more infantry, but integrating Idaho would be really nice. Strax Iron. Look at that. Yes, please. 
So one, two, three states. That's going to take like three separate wars. Taking out Mexico might require two separate wars as well. So I will probably have to extend the end date of this campaign, which is totally fine with me. I don't really care. That's fine with me. Oh. All right, Iceland goes bankrupt. That's fine. And when you go to war with these guys again in... I can take him to go down now, but 27. It's not bad. The Bulgarian-Albanian War, huh? Well, that's nice. Mexico, when's the next time we go to war with you? El Paso integrated. Look at that. Great. El Paso has been integrated. Oh, there's a division there. Beautiful. And now we're in another military stop. Let's get oil-driven ships. Uh, that seems pretty good. Modern naval fleet. Uh, we could do that stuff. Let's do better roads. Get the best roads. So now in El Paso, let's take a look here. Uh, Native Americans are finally assimilating. Native Americans will assimilate. South Germans, Bulgarians, Tartars. Oh, this is beautiful. Uh, African Americans are not assimilating. Uh, maybe we should have gotten rid of them. Russians are assimilating? Oh, man. Okay, so El Paso right now is at what percentage? It's at 37.34.7. Let's go back to them later on and see how much our core population is, or how much of the population is. Dallas as well. Okay, cool. It is actually like Dixie. So right now it's 51% Dixie. So we'll see what happens in the future. And we're still losing money. Hmm. Hmm. We're spending too much on the social programs, aren't we? Oh boy, did Germany break our lines? No, they didn't. Uh, sure, Russia. Is wow, wow. But hey, we're 3.42. Infamy, not bad. Keep going. We'll get out of there pretty quickly. What's going on? Uh, spheres, spheres, spheres. It's fine. Whatever. It's so weird. I mean, I guess there's a lot of revanche support and stuff, but uh. Americans, they're extremely fascist. Holy crap, look at that. 88%, and that's one of the territories that has less fascism. Look at all this. New York City. Can you ever say Long Island has like 90% fascist of what people believe here? 91% fascist. Man, when you lose war, that's really bad. If you want to read about this, please go right ahead. Research speed, more prestige, segregation. First traction of St. Augustine. Nice, nice, nice. Another army is done. Um, we might want to continue sending soldiers over to the UK. Actually, since we're here anyway, it's going to New York because that last war was pretty pretty devastating to some of our armies. Uh, what do you guys need down here? You could use maybe another artillery. Thank you. Huh, they're both Dixie. Wow. Um, 17 and 19. You guys actually are 1970. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, Eight, nine, ten. Cool. And then we'll do some of uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and then armor. Not bad. Oh, uh, yeah, we can still complete that, but give us a few more months and we'll have it done. I'm going to lose Parada because I don't want to become more socialist, I guess, at this point. What, what is the ideology like? It's definitely just so divided. People's ideologies, what matters is the voters' ideologies. 24%, 24%, but we have the reactionary there, so. 70% fascist. Compared to prohibition? Um, sure, why not? Why not? The restoration of Egypt. Diplomats from Egypt have quietly approached us, appealing for help in restoring their lost lands. The Confederate, they say, Egypt, uh, will prove a much more worthier ally. Those are, there are those who are concerned with troubles that this might stir up, however. Should we look the other way to prove Confederate influence's weight? They are our ally, and they, we do want to fight these guys, but we shall do it. Has agreed? Free allied corps. Oh, this is against Turkey. I'll be against, like, the UK. Man, I don't really want to go to Turkey. I'll be sorry. Uh, I, I am sorry about that, but whatever. I don't want to fight the Turks. I got bigger, more global ambitions than fighting the Turks right now. Slovak Austrian War. So the Spanish and the Austrians are trying to fight each other or fight these guys over. That yeah, I don't know, man. I don't think you're gonna do be, be that successful. But maybe that's just me, man. Pan Slavic. The Chinese are conservative reactionaries. Japanese are conservative, fascist, conservative. Oh, look at that. 
Now what do people want? Drink a pension, stand on work day, I'll stand on work day, that's fine with me. Totally, totally, totally fine with me. Because sometimes you need to take a break. Oh, ideological indoctrination mass propaganda. Well, America is America. America is allied with Yugoslavia, of course. Alright then. Hey, you're done. Great. Come to Nevada. I'll go back to Las Vegas sometime. Someday. Maybe I'll film, I'll film it next time I go. Alright, how's Hawaii looking? Because we, now we have one infamy almost. At this point, I think we can probably go to war with the UK. So, let's go and send you guys home. Because we have quite a few armies already in Spain. Our ally. See? One, two, three, four. So let's send our guys over. And as long as we've got like, maybe five armies or so, we'll probably be able to beat whatever the British throw, throw at us. As long as we can land successfully. And carefully. It's always good to be careful. Um, what are we losing a lot of money on? Total expenses, education, administration is costing us a whole bunch. Military spending, national stockpile purchases. Wow, that's a lot. Hit a red star. Uh, that's not this plurality. Oh, if you're wondering about this one, please go right ahead. This happens every campaign. My loyal subjects, you receive your be country best at home. Local consciousness goes down. Yes, please. More prestige. Yes, awesome. Third population of 159 million in the drunk tank. Cool. Keep making them guys. We love those bodies. Oh, that's true. We can't keep spending more money here, too. Keys. Nice. And we've almost made roads. Supply limit goes way up. Let's get some more output. Or er, actually, you know what? Uh, economic responsibility uh, output. It's ten thousand score for that. Hyperinflation is not very good. Buying. Oh, it's that one. Tax efficiency. We could use more taxes, right? Actually, what are we buying here? Like, I think off screen I did say like buy a certain amount of this stuff, but I went back to automate already, so I don't think I'm buying anything. Or like, at least I'm not trying to buy it too much. Oh, citizenship demonstration. Okay, well, if you're wondering about that, please go right ahead. Uh, that's fine. One more plurality, that's fine. I don't really care. Whatever. Dr look at them dreadnoughts. I love it. Even though we're going to get way, 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 way more. That's not enough. We can get some more screens, maybe. Here, get some more steam transports. There you go. They'll be done quickly. Those just cover for our uh, dreadnoughts, so. There you go. Turkey, thank you. We love the Turks. Now they're fascists. Alright, so here we go. Complete the golden circle. That's so much infamy. We get so many cores. Look at that. So we have cores on... Oh, we can maybe change this too. Well, maybe not. We saw that one kind of earlier. So much infamy. Alright, so what do we have? Do we have Me all of Mexico? Yes, we, we, we have all of Mexico. Not America. Um, can I tell them to give me my... St I, can't, let's, uh, I don't think we can. That kind of sucks. I should not have puppeted them then. Oh, we can go to war with these guys, though. Ooh. Yeah, I guess technically we can go to war with them right now. That's not going to help us cut down an infamy, though. So I'm thinking there's probably one more episode after this. To get us where we really want to go. Um, acquired course, how much was that? 62, 70, 27, and 43. Uh, let's do Bolivar first, maybe? Oh, people want to join in our wars. Greenland will not accept, neither will Spain. Actually, hold on. Did Germany break our alliance? Yes, he did. Oh, crap. That's not good. Uh, does someone else want an alliance first? No, everyone kind of hates us. You guys? Well, I guess technically, yeah, we did break our relations with everybody. What do you expect? China? No? Hmm. Oh, well, time to go to Venezuela. Or go 627 with... Uh... You know what? Maybe we'll... Miranda, is that, the... is that this one? Azulia. Bolivar. Miranda would be really good, but uh, Zulia. I, I don't really care. I'll be honest. I really don't care. Zulia? Which one is that one? There we go. Get one more month. Actually, we could probably pull down one of these guys. Uh, you. That's all we really need for this. Hopefully. Alright, let's move on in. Maracaibo? I always say that one wrong. Is 
Venezuela. Thank you. Guys, where are you going? We've come to free our cords from the evil clutches of you. We didn't even change our flag either. We're still considered the Confederate States of America, but not the Golden Circle, which kind of sucks, but that's okay. Free quarters, please. Nice. Less conservative support. All right. San Felipe, Caracas. Dividends, very nice. Well, we're not really cutting down infamy now, but whatever. Venezuela's gone bankrupt? Well, I mean, that was kind of the plan. So now it's 27 score still. Yep, that's good. 27 plus. That should be good enough. So let's wait one more uh, war with these guys and we'll have them done and good. We could send those guys over there, but eh, maybe come down back. Never know what might happen in Panama City. There you go. Alright, not bad. Doesn't look great. God dang it, I should have... Uh, man, that's my fault. I was going to look not very great, but whatever. Alright, so that's the case. You guys, I'm going to send you to... Uh, send them go to San Felipe. And one of you guys go back up here. Because we could probably use you guys up here, honestly. So there you go. Um, let's see. Eh, go into that too. Why not? Might as well, right? Hey, now we're at peace. Let's stay at peace for now, because actually, we need to save some more money. Um, let me go just a little bit more. A little bit more. Oh, we got some elections going. Supply consumption goes way down. Rear area dumps. Very nice. More attack and defense. Anger against the government. Well, when, when do you not have anger against the government? Like, for realsies. Expand that naval port. Nice. And I'll send you guys home too. Uh, sure, Egypt, sure. Beautiful. How's that other fleet looking? Soldiers looking okay. I mean, they're just pretty much ready to go. And what are we missing? One. Blaine? Okay, well, oh, there they are. There you go. Surge of liberalism, alright. Head on over here and make another one. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, ten. I get a plane. One. Two, and now infantry. Three. Four. Seven, and... Eight. Should be good enough, right? Should be good enough. Chile? Sure, why not Chile? So do we actually get cores on these? Oh, we do get cores on them. Okay, so that actually makes sense. So we can just go to war them whenever we want, then. Hmm. I would say let's build up our reserves of money first just because we're going to spend a lot of money going to war and right now we went to war we could hold on to the war for a while but address the parliament if you want to about that please go right ahead yes please please lose more consciousness what but banat oh, germany why did you want banat to be free of all things sakim suppression or submission well all right we could go to war now. We do have quite a few armies around here. Uh, let's see. I'm trying to make another one too. I'll send you guys over here as well. You guys are well, actually having ten dreadnoughts. I mean, that's really good. Look at all that. And twenty nine screens, including just cruisers. This is a pretty powerful, strong navy. So I'll send them to Spain for now. And we have all these guys we could send over as well. Surge of fascism. Look at that. We'll keep an eye on this. <laughs> Could we actually turn fascist in the end? That'd be kind of funny. Uh, actually, you guys could probably use more ships, honestly. We only have a few dreadnoughts with this fleet, so. Immigration rights, more attack is very nice. 
And we're already done with all of our military stuff, so a police matter worse, that's fine. Uh, oh, Turku. I forget where Turku is. Uh, boom, boom, boom. Illinois is getting a lot better. New England still taking some work. These guys are finally done in Sonora. Thank goodness. Um, you guys still need some work down there. Obviously, the states that we take just take so long to get more efficiency up here, so. Afro Caribino, Caribino, uh, workers' unions. Technically, these are our cores. So let's do our cores first. They should go up pretty darn quickly. Mayan, and you know what? I'll show you the pops. Oh my goodness. So, the states that we slowly take over from America are slowly becoming more, more Dixie. 43% here. California is almost completely Dixie, and we have some Caribino here too. Look at all this. Former Mexican territory. Look at the Baja California. Sonora. Oh, it's so good. And even Texan culture is disappearing in favor of Dixie culture. Oh, look at that. That's majority Dixie now. Down here, Central America is almost completely Dixie. Look at that. That's so good. I love Vicky too. This is just... I love it so much. This is one of my favorite games of all time. I mean, look at that. That's so good. Even up here, look. Yeah, maybe not up there. Maybe not too much. It's not It's not getting there yet, but that's why we put bureaucrats here. Um, yeah. Just wow. Uh, over here, look at this. Uh, this used to be majority Dixie, but now it's a majority Caribino, but it's barely, barely majority of that. Even part of Cuba is becoming Dixie. Southern culture. <sighs> and there's still Polynesian down here too, but, you know, whatever. It's just, oh, I love it. I love it so much. Actually, let's take a look at the other people, too. So, there's a lot of Occitan down here. Uh, there's quite a few Germans in the Sudetenland, some French in Alsace-Lorraine. Got some Walloons in Belgium, some Flems. Uh, there's a lot of Irish in southern England. Huh. There's Germany is doing quite well around here. The Poles are doing quite well as well. The Balkans are a giant mess. But actually, it's not really extremely terrible, it looks like. But still a mess, no matter what you say. Um, Tatar... Turks are doing okay. I mean, I played as Turkey in HPM, and I definitely did better than that, but, uh, what's it down here? There's some Mishriki down there. All right, China is kind of Chinese. So not too radical, but America's looking just, or our America's looking just so good. Just so tasty. I love it. Um, actually, uh, since we're sending them over there, I might send you guys up here. I just want to see what's going on in the UK. Can we successfully invade Scotland? That's my question. Because I don't mind cutting down some of my stuff here. Dogma violence. Declare martial law. Uh, there you go. Do that one. Oh, white piece. Even more... Are we going to become fascist? Do that one. Actually, since you guys are already here, come up here. Send other fleet home. That's fine. We, I want to keep at least one fleet home for now. Just kind of see what, what they have. Because we might just go to war with them now. Uh, what do we have? That, no one's in Scotland. If we come up all the way up to here. Mountains. Three defense. Now, moving into any other style will be god-awful, but that's okay. You guys stay here for now. Because we have one, two, three, four, five armies. That's obviously not enough. Um, we want to deal with these guys as well. I would like a great power ally first, though. Uh, who are they allied with? Ah, uh, the ally with the Chinese. Japan, would you like an alliance? Yes, they would. And the conservative and reaction parties with only 33% of the vote. Man, we're becoming more and more divided here. Oh, Bill Gary's getting their crap pushed in by Egypt? Or Turkey? Turkey, wow. Alright, so we got one of these guys back, which is nice. Um, mutual funds are almost done, which are nice as well. Send you guys to Bilbao. That's fine with us. Actually, who's a really good defensive general? You're not... Uh, Hayes is plus one. Ezra is nothing. Plus one. And then you are... Can we get someone else who is good on defense? You're not good on attack, but you're okay on defense. Not great. You guys... This guy really sucks. Where are our defensive leaders? Just because I want to make sure we do okay, but at the same time, we do go to war with America in two years, too, and then back to Mexico. Seriously, no one's good on defense. I guess that people aren't learning how to be good defensive generals. Oh, there we go. Wilcox, there you go. You're going to lead the assault and... Uh, head on over here. You guys head on down here too. There you go. Put yourselves around. Uh, more tax efficiency is going to be very nice. As When we get the other group, we're going to start spending some more money too, probably. Advanced metallurgy. Oh, we, we definitely need some more training though. If that's the case, go and start spending more money now. This stuff, steam of convoys. Oh, look at that. It just went straight down. Um, we're doing okay there. 
Go up by five. Per, per, oh, Italy, what are you doing? Oh, are you, we're actually, oh, the Italians, what are you doing? You don't need me to help you with Croatia. You really don't need... Italy. Italy. That helps offset the cost a little bit more. I don't mind taxing the, the capitalists. Just maybe a little bit more as well. Here they come on. And... That didn't really help us out too much, did it? Alright, so these guys have landed. It gives us one more month to help repair guys and get more spending and such. Sweden? Probably a really bad idea going to war with these guys. Alright, give us one more month. The wave of colonial unrest. The situation will pass. Still make more divisions. Buying on margin. Nice. Less factory cost is very good. Fortunately, we're all out of coffee, though, but whatever. Alright, so these guys are looking okay. Let's send both guys up north. There you go. Alright, boys, let's head on up to Scotland. And see what we can do just in case. I'm sending two armies up. Or, yeah, two armies up first. <clears throat> That's way too many guys. Go to 40%. I don't want to tax the capitalists anymore. Or the rich people. There you go. Simply these strikes. Uh, there we go. <clears throat> Excuse me. Wait for the other group to get here first. Excuse me, sir. We would like a moment of your time to talk about how we need more of your territory. Actually, what can we get from them? Just with these guys. Choir Corps, Choir American Corps. Oh, uh, that'd be 12, 16, 12, and 16. <coughs> well, my goal is to really take both. Um. Well, you know, just give it one more month. Give it one more month. Let's cut down infamy just a little bit more. There we go. Happy 1926, everyone. Alright, well, let's do it. I don't care which one we take first. I don't think we have any territory that's next to them. Uh, well, technically there, but we're not really allied with these guys, so that's fine with us. You guys kind of hold yourselves there. Uh, what are you guys doing? Oh, we're still... <clears throat> we still have guys all around the place here. Oh, you guys are looking really bad. Wow, that's really bad, actually. Ooh, that's not good. Do we have any other rebels here? Hopefully not. What are we making here? Well, hopefully they don't die on the, on the way over there. So, we'll see what happens. Everyone will accept, except for Jap the Empire of Japan and Austria. And Italy. We're by ourselves. Inverness? Um, I don't want to do two at a time. Aberdeen? Oh, that's not really good. Both of you guys come here, then. Would you like an alliance with Germany? Probably not. Well, they don't want to be our allies, so be it. We don't need them. We're the most strong. Why are we fighting Russia? Can Russia even handle a war? They're so pan Slavic, but still. Baltimore, I guess. And of course, the Yankee Patriots. That's fine. I'm not really too worried about them since we're spending so much on our military, anyways, right now, so. Uh, you guys can do that too. There you go. Head on out. I don't know. So you guys will need at least... No, you got the engineers. Two artillery. That's all you need is two artillery up there. Um, let's go to artillery right there for now. And they will need three infantry. Two artillery and three infantry. One. Two. And then... Three infantry. Where are we going to go that from? One. Two. Three. There you go. Helps balance it out a little bit more. Thank you, Patriots. As soon as these guys land, yeah, we're going to go and switch these guys around and come over here and grab some more guys. Going to keep blockading them for now. Panama, Panama Canal Dividends. Very nice. Oh, we got the first one. I'm just going to send one guy over here to see what happens. I want to keep this tile as a last resort, because these are both hills. That's not very good to defend in, so... We'll see first. I don't have a lot of confidence in that. Actually, or we can send more guys in here. Let's get more guys. Oh, a lot of rebels up here, huh? It's alright. These guys are heading up there. How long could it last? Wow. A lot of rebels, huh? 
Well, we, need, we know how to teach them a lesson or two. Burlington, 129,000. Well, hey, look at that. You sunk up two enemy ships. All right, you boys, get on the boat, and you move up and get ready to go. All right, well, we could try it, I guess. Oh, and now they're starting to attack us, of course. Uh, there's really no good defensive position here, so that's actually really bad for us, but... Get your butts up there. You guys go there, and you guys go in. Lewiston? Oh, oh, oh boy. We have more ships, but they have more heavy ships. We have way more transports, though. So we're going to lose probably... Oh, the control is lost, huh? That's not good. Where are our boys? There you are. All right, boys, head on in. Uh, this is probably actually really bad then. Huh. Oh, we lost control of this group. Well, oh, they must have got access through there. That's fine. Whatever. Send so you guys over here. I don't really care. We'll see what happens. If this doesn't go well, I'll make sure we'll go. We'll do well off screen to sell. Make sure all is well. I mean, we're starting to lose some ships, but so are they, so. 27 20. Oh, we're definitely losing some ships. Head on in. Uh, they do have a crossing. We do. Oh, well, they don't have gas defense, so that definitely helps us out. All that matters is that we win this battle. That's all that matters. Where is our other fleet? Here. Go ahead and dump them off here first. Uh, sure, Tricky. You want to come on in? That's fine with us. Drop them off, thank you. Head on down here. Kill the entire fleet. This has got to be the fleet. We've got, we've got to have more ships than they do now. Get those dreadnoughts in there, boys. Get those dreadnoughts. Second most prestigious industry, not bad. Edward Hill, you're actually plus four. Oh, we did get a really good defensive guy here. Oh, now they're dropping like flies. Look at that. We lost 50 ships. That's really bad, actually. Um, I'm going to send both of you guys home then. And by home, you're going over here. And then you really can't transport too many more things right now, but that's fine. How are we doing down here? Uh, they are attacking. You might actually help out. Yep, kill them off. We're actually losing thousands of guys. Why are we losing so many guys? You're gassing us, huh? All right, well, get out of there then. Don't ever trust Colombians. <clears throat> Still, it could be worse. So, we just repaired. I'm going to send you guys back actually home. The Dreadnoughts pretty much all survived. The Steam Transports did not, which makes 100% sense. Uh, you guys, don't worry about it. Get on the boat. Feed the hungry. There you go. Good. Every ship you see, they, you kill them off. Oh, we're up here already? Beautiful. Uh, seriously, finishes... Uh-oh! The Confederate British War of American Restoration becomes a Great War. Well, I kind of figured that would happen. Who joined our side? Chile. Colombia. Canada. Oh, Canada's no longer a puppet! Why? Canada, why? Ah! Now they're no longer a puppet! Why? <laughs> oh, that's why I don't like having puppets in Vicky 2. That's really why. Oh, God, it's going to be a Great War. Oh, man. Drop them off here. They can walk into Inverness and whatnot. Nice. Also, oh, they, they definitely. Wait, hold on. Are we attacking? I mean, we're gassing them. Don't, well, I guess. Huh. All right, well, whatever. All right, our ships are almost making it back home, so they can definitely repair and get some more transports. So that'd be nice. Now, if that's the case, we're probably going to lose a few on the way over there. That's fine. Do that. Do not. There you go. Get some more. Help him out.
Hey, help him out. Kill off all the British ships. You see a single British ship, you kill them off. Oh! Look at that. We actually won there. Nice. Thank you, my allies. Thank you. They all deserve to die down there. Actually, what's immigration like right now, then? We're still getting 11,000 people. Not bad. Are we still gassing them? Yes, we are. We got a really good dash roll. We didn't, but that's alright. Alright, so now we're down here. Kill these stupid British ships. The British Navy is a joke. We gotta make sure it's a joke. For the rest of time. This guy's a... Not too bad, actually. Good. You see their ships? You kill them. Uh, sure, Austria. Oh, we lost a battle. I, I clicked on that too fast. My bad. They don't accept? Well, you said you wanted to be allies, but that was proven to be a lie. There you go. Now I got more screens. And they're actually looking a lot better here. Um, we need two more infantry, which would be very good. Actually, yeah, two more infantry. Hmm. And we'll throw you probably right in the kerfuffle, actually. If you don't move first. Right there. Hey! Lost five ships, but that's fine. Totally okay with me. Oh, look at that. They have less than 32,000 soldiers now. Pretty good. Go home and repair for now. That's fine with us. It's almost the end of the month, and you'll get some more score. Great! 90%. Nice! Belgium wants an alliance? So you telling me you want to come in. Why is it minus 29%? Because of the battles? Hmm. I don't believe you. But Belgium, huh? They will not accept? Well, then you didn't really want to be allies. Alright, not bad. Looking almost all 100%. Not all of them, but a lot of them. Hey, we get some reforms. 8 hour workday, 20% of the population wants that. Why not? There you go. Battle of the Irish Sea. Very good. And we might be able to siege down Northern Ireland, too. That'd actually be pretty nice. Yeah, head into there, guys. Uh oh, they're starting to run out of guys. And then we'll come down here, too. There you go. We're running out of soldiers down here to transport, but that's alright. We got guys down here, too. Nice, 35. Uh, they're looking good enough that we probably can transport them over anyway, so let's go and do that. We need more dreadnoughts here, definitely. Holy crap. There you go. They'll die. There's not enough soldiers there to do anything, so. Oh, uh, yeah. The girl from Albuquerque? I want to see how many men will die in this battle. I really want to see that. Straight to Dover. Very good. Oh, why would you... Oh, guys. Guys, guys. Oh, more morale. Grand battle plan versus superior firepower? That sounds like quite four stuff. Improved anti-aircraft stuff. Nice. We're still gassing them, so. Oh, the battle. Oh, I mean, that makes sense. Russia's actually trying to show up, huh? They fully mobilize. I've yet to mobilize, so. I knew we'd lose a few transports. Hello. Baroda, huh? Hey, Italy, if you want to come into the war. Actually, where's Italy? There you are. Don't ask me to join the war if you're not going to join, so. Use one more infantry here. Hmm. So French is going to war with somebody or, or what? Yeah. Oh, they're going to go to war with Belgium. All right. It's all right. It's whatever. Well, I guess it's, let's go to this side. I want to avoid that fleet for now. Come to here. Come to Dundee. I really want to see the casualties of this battle. Hey, another one died? Italy. Stop doing it. If you don't want to join the war, stop asking me to join. Actually, we don't need to throw any more guys in there. Great. More naval organization. Oil-driven ships. Let's grab that one. Uh, I'll get this one first. That's really, really fast. That's 25, 2600, 2600. That's so fast. Um, you know, don't go to Edinburgh. Just go here first. That's fine. These ships should do relatively okay. Come over here. Does that help if the war effort if we actually blockade the Navy here? Or blockade them? That actually might increase some score here. Actually, we're going to try to fight their ships down there south. Um, terrain, no, it doesn't really help us out. I mean, we're still gassing them, which I, which is awesome. I love gassing our enemies, don't you? Oh, you're, you're here transporting ships. Good. Transporting more soldiers. Great. 
You guys are just gonna hang out. You guys head down here too. Isle of Man. I want to find that enemy fleet. Cool. Banat Republic. I don't really care. I'll be honest. There you go. Actually, we can probably start sieging these guys down too. Um, what would you guys say up there? Actually, come back. Come back. Go from Huntington. Very good. Get on the boat and head down here. Sure, France. You want to come over? That's fine. See what happens. So we got some good guys here. So we got some good guys here. Uh, let's see. Did we make that one division? We did not yet. No. Just in case. Make another guard. It's fine. What the hell are you doing? Oh my god. Stop it. Get on the stupid boat. Are they running out of soldiers or something? They might be. There you go. Now head down here, guys. Good. Fire control systems might as well. There you go. And let's go ahead and siege down Northern Ireland. Look at that. So good. Keep gassing them. Keep gassing them. They don't deserve life. Alright, so you guys head around and see if we can continue blockading them. Let's see what happens. Because I know they have a, quite a big fleet around here somewhere. Navy attrition goes down, which is very good to see. Oh, more soldiers. Well, I'm surprised they're not throwing more soldiers in here. Usually they like to throw as many soldiers as possible into here. And that those that ship is going to die. Good, good, good. Irish Sea. Well, we might just win the war here with enough scores. But just Parliament, if you want to worry about that, please go ahead. Let's lose some consciousness. Thank you. And Greece. Yeah. We're influencing them, so that'll be good. Alright. Increase opinion. It's minus 43%, but let's be real. It's it's going to become greater than this. I will siege down all of the UK if I have to. And you know what? We need to do Russia too. So be it. Weapon platform. Very nice. Get some more attack. Oh, wait. No! No! Why did it... <sighs> I'm too used to clicking that. My apologies about that. Oh, my apologies. 100% my apologies. Oh, I mean, you can go back and see whatever we need to see, but... Dismantle the... You know, we're going to go all the way. I apologize for that. That's completely my fault. Completely, 100% my fault. I should not have clicked that fast. You can probably go back and see it. And someone did post in the last episode or two episodes ago, like, the ratings for uh, what happened and the casualties and the good battles, the bad battles that we had. So, um, yeah, we'll see. You know what, we could probably see these guys down pretty darn... Ooh, quickly. Well, Newfoundland's the next battle, I guess. Go and leave, go and leave, 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 leave. That's fine. We lost 20,000. Actually, we killed off 40,000 of them. Italy. We're gonna keep... Are we gonna keep dancing like this, Italy? This is the last time. Where's Italy? Oh, we're influencing them, that's why. Italy. Italy usually starts with an I. Alright, so that's the last time I was going to do with them, so. Alright. How many more men do you want to die, Britain? Oh, look at this. British Commonwealth? No. 13 times Great War? No, because I want that other tile as well. That's what we want. 59%. That's Antilles, yes. It's only 4 score. Enemy by enemy, be worried about that, please go right ahead. Um, you know what? We don't need more allies. We're doing okay. Cultural enrichment is very nice. And where's our other fleet? Oh, you guys are here. Let's send you guys home, actually. So we can pick up a few more transports and heal. So that'd be good. Actually, you guys are looking very good, too. Awesome. It's actually one of the easier times so far I've had actually dealing with the Brits, I'll say. Head down here. Kill them off. Can we gas them? Oh, okay. So I'm glad I didn't click on anything here. Now we lost 3,500 versus 140,000 Brits. That's impressive. They would not accept this offer. Well, we'll keep going in then. We'll keep going in. And we're going to send our best soldiers out maybe to... Actually, well, send uh, all but you. Should be able to slaughter them here. That's nice. Send one of you guys back up north here too. Nope. You wanted it like this, so... And send you guys over here. Uh-oh. The tables have turned. Churchill is really good on attack and defense. Less morale and less experience, but Ezra Wise is pretty good on attack. The war is upon us. 
you want to read about that, please go right ahead. Beautiful. And we just casually killed off 66,000 more soldiers. Not bad. Forward. If you want to read about that, please go right ahead. Socialist, all laborers in Idaho, craftsmen in Idaho. Yeah, that's probably better. Which one's. Yeah, they're both exactly the same. Yeah, they're pretty much exactly the same. Oh, failed summit. Oh, crap. Oh, that's fine. Oh, yeah, that's fine. That's fine. Alright, naval build times. White piece with those uh, guys, whatever. Now they're gonna attack us here probably very, very soon. So we just gotta be ready for it. Oh, hello. Or not. Whoa, 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 We well ally with Germany. Uh is Germany at war with someone else? France and Russia. Uh no. I'm okay. Archaeological expedi expedition exhibition, cool. Place in the sun? Yeah. Don't really care too much. That's a lot of dudes. Uh, you know what? Keep you guys here. Ah. Uh, well, we can get the West Indies and dismantle their empire too. And we want to get out of this war so we can go back to war with America soon, so. Oh, we're war South Africa and Greece? I don't really care. Well, this is what we really want to do. We don't get to fully siege them down, but, you know, if they dismantle the Empire, we might see some really good stuff here. And we need some more some more uh, infamy reduction to get this stuff done. So, you know what? It's probably good to do this. 57%. Capitulate. Third of a million. We lost 24,000. A third of a million British boys has died for literally nothing. That can't go very well now, can it? But we've done it, my friends. We have done it. We have achieved peace and beaten up the Brits. And we've gotten our rifle territory back. But I think it'll be one more episode in which we'll probably quickly go through America a few times, as well as Mexico, to get all of our claims and territory, and maybe even Venezuela as well, even though uh, they're allied with the Germans and the Canadians, which is unfortunate. But if you enjoyed this video, leave a like, subscribe if you're new, check out my Discord link in the description below, and I'll see you tomorrow in probably what will be the last episode. Thanks for watching. Have a great rest of your day.